everybody to ESPN's College Football Primetime and Jimmy V Week for Cancer Research as we continue our commitment to the V Foundation and Jim Valvano's dream to defeat cancer. This is the 2010 Dr. Pepper ACC Championship game between two of the top 21 teams in the country. So the Hokies in white will kick off Justin Meyer has a very strong leg slipped as he approached the ball on this wet field. And the return to the 34 yard line. Play action fake by Manuel and a deep throw across midfield. Taiwan Easterling for Florida State fights his way down to the third offensive lineman of the ACC second year in a row he's won that. And he's been first team all ACC three times. First down, they convert on third down to Rodney Smith. And J. Ron Hosley leads the country in interceptions with eight. Manuel showing his running skills inside the 15. Chopped down at the 14. I Jones has committed running back as Manuel goes out of the gun on third down and two. Given plenty of time again, has a man open, and it's incomplete. Easterling had it knocked away by Eddie Witt. From just inside the right hash mark. And it is good. Performance so far this year. On third and one, Williams has the first down, stays on his feet, and made the 37 yard line. Boy, he's tripped up by Anthony with running ability. Evans is a bruiser inside. Wilson has excellent speed. Great bounce to the outside by Williams and another first down. Run out of third and long, third and 14. Not much pressure on Taylor. And it's incomplete along the near sideline for Marcus Davis with Greg Reed in coverage. Behind Manuel goes under center. Faked it to Thompson to throw a nice block and the pass is intercepted. And it's going to be run in for a touchdown by Gouveia Winslow. And returned it 26 yards. Virginia Tech with a 7 to 3 lead after the extra point by Chris Hayes. Five receivers now on third down and 11 for E.J. Manuel. Quarterback draw. And they weren't fooled. Lindell Gibson, the middle linebacker. Aaron Evans is checked in now at running back. And he gets the call straight ahead through the defense. They have an angle on him. And they knock him out of bounds near the 10 yard line. Mr. Alexander with the stop. They'll mark it at the nine. First, first and goal from the nine. Evans again inside the five into the end zone. Touchdown, Virginia Tech. Chris Paisley adds the extra point. 14. Drive the result in the field goal with E.J. Manuel quarterback. He throws and it's caught by Taiwan Easterling with the defender draped all over him. Outfielder on the Florida State baseball team. Manuel on the roll has a receiver again. Easterling another jumble but he held on for a first down. In the Virginia Tech territory to the 30. He's their second leading receiver for the year with 38 catches now. A man open again and is caught. Willie Halstead couldn't stay on his feet. If he had, it was a touchdown. Gives him first and goal. There's the true freshman Fuller went for the double move and then Ty Jones punched it in. Touchdown, Florida State. Justin Hopkins has now made 81 consecutive PATs. Three of the ACC championship game. First time Charlotte has hosted this game. Taylor on third down and nine. Has a man wide open after the scramble. Danny Cole. First down to the 49-yard line. An everyday back. And he's learning how to run inside. But his speed to the outside is exceptional. Taylor 
throws. First down, Jared Boykin to the 40 yard line of Florida. Taylor lost it out for Wilson. Slowed down enough by Xavier Rhodes. Taylor, the rush man fell down, and it's a touchdown to Jared Boykin. Steps in retreat to get himself some room and then throw a pass. And that's what he did there. Went all the way back to the foot tonight. Rush on Manuel has a receiver across midfield and a first down. Willie Hall. <laughs> That'd be nice to have to take a pay cut and still make about 17 million a year. Here's Halstead broke a tackle and advanced inside the 20. Returned last week after missing the previous game against Maryland with a concussion. Ty Jones turned the corners near another first down. They're going to give him most four-year starter and left guard for Florida State. And they run behind him. Now bounced outside. Touchdown, Ty Jones. Second TD of the night. And Dustin Hopkins adds the extra. <laughs> Tyrod Taylor comes out throwing to Danny Cole out of bounds at the 40. They have the people to do it. He lets them do it. Second and six. Ryan Williams near another first down at the 45 yard line of Florida State. Tyrod Taylor keeps. And Virginia Tech is now six for seven on third. Stood so the defense can finally get off the field here. Taylor sacked again. Marcus White. That'd be a big loss for Virginia Tech. Taylor's their leading tackler. Tyrod Taylor over the middle. Caught. Low throw. So Danny Cole had to go down for it. No run after. There are the Hokies. Good protection. Taylor throws. Marcus Davis. A great catch. Greg Reed an excellent cover. Third down's been a key so far tonight for Virginia Tech. Can they keep rolling on third now? Yes, they can if the pass is on target. Paul is wide open. Touchdown, Virginia Tech. Seven yards and seven plays. Chris Hazley's extra point. Makes it 28-17. Bridge out there trying to stop this third and eight for Florida State. Manuel. Looked like he wanted to run. Throws to the far sideline. Short of the first down. Chris Thompson was swung out of bounds by Tariq Edwards, a backer. They've been an excellent rushing team. Can they convert on third and a short too? Yes, and it's Wilson. Who's considered the best outside runner of the bunch, but he can go in order for the Seminoles to win their division. And Maryland helped the cause. Jared Boykin. Gets another first down. Took the pass and there with only this in the bowl game left. He has a receiver open again. Wilson touchdown. That's just a fantastic read by Ty. 48 to mark for Brian Randall. An extra point up and good by Hazley. And Virginia Tech, the good field position after the kickoff. E.J. Manuel bounced off a pile. High throw, caught. First down. 37-yard line. Burt Ree, seventh in the ACC. Third down and 12. Manuel throws and has his man, Burt Reed to the 20. And another first down from Ponder, who's been battling major elbow problems on first and goal. A spin into the end zone. Touchdown, Ty Jones. His third of the night. Good awareness. Rolled on top of the tackler. Just good awareness. Kinesthetically speaking. Yes. Hopkins the extra point. Ready for the National Football League draft. And ready in 
do is 100%. He's a guy you cheer for. Tremendous person in addition to his football talents. Andre Smith, the catch, and he bounced out to the 40 tonight for Tyrod Taylor. Now 23 touchdowns for the year and only four interceptions. Going for the home run ball, looking for Jared Boykin, and it is incomplete with Mike Harris in coverage. And that's one, there's only a through or down. Five for five in the second half. And again, plenty of time for Taylor. Waits for a man to come open. Danny Cole trying to run away inside the 10. Defensive approach tonight. I think the Florida State coaches might kick themselves after this game. Taylor running around. This is what they're afraid of, and he scores. Chris Hazley is on for the extra point. And it is blocked. And the Seminoles have it. Nigel Bradham gets a block. And he is going to score. There is a flag down. Back at the eight yard line. Looks right where the holder was. I wonder if it's not roughing on the holder. On the kicking team, number 31. That penalty's declined. Good. Point is good. Trailing with ten and a half minutes to go. They get it off hurriedly. Manuel has a man. Relaford, the tight end, with some run after the catch to get him near a game. And filled in this year for Ponder. And beat Clemson. Quick throw, and they couldn't catch it. Was behind Willie Halstead and a little bit low. Manuel with time, high throw, and it's intercepted. Davon Morgan still on his feet. And back to the 35 yard line. Handling abilities would set them off. Another third down for the Hokies. This time they do not convert. They were 12 out of 15 before being stopped there by Nigel Bradfield. We've seen a lot of the kickers slipping. Good snap and hold. And a good kick. He got it. And that is huge. It turns it back into a three-score game. It's and he's a talented guy. Raw, but talented. It'll be fun to watch him develop. Third down, Manuel throws. It's caught, but it looks to be short of the first down. Rodney Smith, a 52nd straight start. If he doesn't fall right behind that left guard. Well, instead, it's a deep handoff, and they get stuffed. Chris Thompson didn't make it. John Graves with the penetration. Fourth down, a long yard here for Virginia Tech, trying to put this one away. Tyrod Taylor fittingly does it himself. Under three minutes to go, they move the chains. Five days later, against James Madison, and lost that game too, and the season could have been a total disaster. And now they're going to win 11 games in a row. And again, we'll go back to joined by 15 of the other very best football players and students in the country. And he has the great honor of being picked to represent those 16 scholar athletes who get postgraduate scholarships. Hopefully we'll get that elbow healthy in time for their bowl game. Manual throws. Caught for a first down. Conversion on fourth down. Burt Reed tackled by Jack Tyler. Eight yard gain. Height from two and a half hours away in Blacksburg. Manual very close to the line of scrimmage. It's caught. There is a flag now. Chris Thompson credited with a touchdown. At the goal line, but I believe they have an illegal forward pass. Line of scrimmage. As a result, it is a touchdown. Hopkins on. And the extra point's good. It's an 11-point game. Congratulations. Tyrod Taylor takes a knee. And the highest scoring championship game of the six in the history of the ACC championship has come to its conclusion. Frank Beamer now two and eight against Florida State.
They have lost 13 of the last four. Stay tuned for Sports Center for postgame coverage of this, including the award ceremony. Tune in to ESPN3.com. Now for Matt Millen, Heather Cox, and our crew, Sean McDonough saying so long from Charlotte. Here's Sports Center.